So, you want to make a cool character with cool sunglasses? Well, that's just you. You're looking in the mirror. Hey guys, I'm Matt Death by Kai. I'm Kai, and today we're back once again taking a look at Ace Sprite. This is a pixel art program. You can do this in any program, any program at all that lets you zoom all the way in until you see individual pixels like this. So I'm in a 16 by 16 canvas. What we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and we're going to start off with a, um, a cool little, like, just a color... We'll do green for like a skin tone, like a frog, like kind of like Wicked, I guess, I suppose, which is, which looks kind of like this. So we'll just make like a nice little green to start off with. I'm going to turn Pixel Perfect off so we can just kind of draw in a nice little shape. Um, maybe something that looks a bit like this and then it'll probably go inwards. Um, and then it'll come down like this. And then inwards like that. And there we go. Nice. So it's kind of like. Looking a little bit like this, and you might give it some some legs, maybe some legs, some leggage. Actually, that looks really funny, so we'll do that instead. Actually, um, that looks really funny. Actually, um, maybe move one in. Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. And now I want to go ahead and erase that piece. Maybe put that piece in, and then put this piece. Maybe this will be like a cool little alligator pixel. Ooh, I just smacked my microphone. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. Um, maybe this be like a cool like alligator kind of um thing going on here i want to potentially drop the color make it a little bit more blue and then put the other arm there maybe yeah cool and then the yellow slightly slightly yellow for the tooth one there and one there all well, crocodiles don't really have super long teeth like this but I kind of want to just go ahead and do something like this little teeth there you go um and also uh no it was fine you might just get rid of the arms all together i don't think i really like them i can't lie to you yeah okay and then we'll do like a little tail Kind of also looks like a dinosaur, which that could also be it. It could also be a dinosaur. We might do a dinosaur. Why Why? Why the heck not, you know? A little bit of blue to that. And then like this. There we go. Okay, so now we don't have to worry about the face too much because I want to just go all, all the way across like this because we're actually, we might get rid of the teeth too. I forgot about that. Might not fit. Um, we're going to do sunglasses like this. So it's going to be th like three or three or four. One, one, two, three, four, four of these down then a space in between and three so this is what they get it looks like sunglasses obviously um and then we're gonna go ahead and i'm gonna use the darker color that we had earlier which is about approximately this approximately 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 oh no approximately this and we're just gonna go ahead and create like a little line underneath this and create like a little shadow looking thing which looks really pretty cool if you ask me um so we'll do something like that for the shading wise Maybe something like that and then of course we'll go ahead and put these um like this as well so it looks like it's a little bit in shade you know which looks kind of cool um and maybe uh no no i'll leave it like that i guess maybe maybe not yeah maybe we'll leave it like this that's fine that's fine it looks good um now i want to go ahead and make a lighter green color and we're going to put this on the jawline right there i guess and then on this piece and then on this back piece, and this piece, and this piece. Actually, not that piece. <laughs> there we go. We'll do this. Um, I think this, this looks a little strange. So maybe we can um, bring out some other lines to show what what things are. So we'll create a little line there to make it look like it's, a, it's an arm. And we'll create a line here to do the same thing. So now I guess... We have a dinosaur with two arms, which looks really cool, pretty cool if you ask me. Now, with that done, I'm going to go ahead and make his sunglasses look even cooler than they already do by going ahead and adding a shine. Look at them. Woo! That's pretty cool. Gotta be honest with you. I gotta be honest with you. That's pretty cool. I would love to have that, have that in my new in my new um, wallpaper. Just a big just a big picture of this guy. And it's just my wallpaper on my PC. It's just it's good. We might actually go ahead and redo the tail a teensy weensy bit. So it looks like it goes out like that a little bit. And then on that, so we'll put that there. I, I don't know if I like that. We'll, we'll, just, we'll just give it that. I think he looks really good bald. I'm not going to lie. I think he's one of the, just, he's one of those, you know? He just looks really good bald. 
Um, I like this quite a bit. So let's go ahead and look at it tab to op open up the uh, animation editor. I don't want to do a huge animation for this guy. I literally just want to make a, a quick, simple, cute little, you know, animation and a cute, simple little character um, that fits along with that. So let's go ahead and I'll move everything down by hitting M to box select over top of everything. We'll just hit M to move it all down like that. Hit select, deselect, um, and then hit, hit this little plus button again, add a new layer, and then grab his head, pull his head down. And then we go ahead and grab uh, the second keyframe. Hit do, 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 control C, control V. And as you can see, we now have two frames that are the same. So grab the third frame and then just put your cursor on this uh, yellow line piece. Uh, it has to be, literally has to be on this yellow line. And then just click and drag it to behind the four and make it become the four. So now you can see when we play this, it goes like this. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. So um, next after that, I want to go ahead and let's take a look. Look, he's nodding his head. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and continue this. And the last thing I want to do is add in a little bit more animation detail. So let's go ahead and grab the first, the first frame. Yeah, we'll do the first one. Um, no, first and second one are the same. And then third and fourth uh, kind of bounce back and forth. So let's go. And on the second frame, I kind of want to have the little dinosaur buddy kind of go back a little bit. And then the third frame is like that. And then the other one, it goes like this. I kind of want to do this one to be forward. So as you can see, you can see we have this uh, animation here, but it's kind of slidey, like I said. So to fix that, we'll just make it so it bobs a little bit more. Um, probably on probably on this one actually. It probably goes down a little bit, and then we'll just fix this and put those in. Nice. There we go. That's a, a cute little idle animation for a crocodile or the, the Android logo. I don't know what that is, but it's something. And I hope you, ladies and gentlemen, enjoyed it. We might put like that, but every, it, but it looks like fangs, though, not like teeth. So it's gonna kind of throw things off, maybe. But we'll go ahead and leave it for it now. Hope you, ladies and gentlemen, enjoyed today's tutorial. I will see you in the next one. But until then, bye bye.